Welcome to Tune Tracks Racing. I am your host, Chris. This is Jason. And today for Threes Racing will be the last day of the regular season for Season 2. Threes Racing is sponsored by JLHCraft.com Racing. Please check the description below for your diecast racing accessory needs. So, Groups 18 and 19 will be going today. So let's take a quick look at Group 18. Driving in the McLaren Senna, we got Liam's Hot Garage. In the Lamborghini Sesta Elemento, we have Diecast Dragger. And Ragtag Racing Garage will be in a 64 Nova Wagon Gasser. So let's kick things off. Race 1. And the first race of the day is off. Going around the bend, then Nova hits the wall and he's stuck. The McLaren Senna takes the lead, passes the Sesta Elemento and grabs the first win of the day. Grabbing three points, and the Nova says hello to the safety wall, and he is out of race one. So taking another look, the Nova with the inside lane loses control, slams into the safety wall, which gives him a DNF, and the McLaren Senna walks right in and grabs the win, which marks the first career win for Liam's Hot Garage. Coming in second with Diecast Dragger and Assessed Elemental with two, and unfortunately Ragtag Racing Garage suffered a DNF and has zero points. Race 2! And the teams are off and running. And going around the bend. And then crashes. And that he did. And the Sesto Elemento loses first place to the Nova Wagon Gasser. And the Senna unfortunately suffers a DNF. And that will give him zero points for this race. Whipping around the bend. The Senna lost control. Veers to the inside lane and collides with the safety wall and it looked like the Sesto Elemento was going to walk away with an easy win but Ragtag Racing Garage has other plans as he comes in from behind and steals the victory. So after two races, Diecast Dragger is hanging on to first place by a point. Race 3. They're off. And the last race of Group 18 is off. And all three teams make it around the bend. And Assisto Elemento gets his revenge on the Nova Wagon Gasser as he returns the favor and snatches victory from defeat. And Diecast Dragger has walked away with the victory for Group 18. This was crazy. It sure was, Jason. And Diecast Dragger comes out of nowhere and grabs his first career win. And that'll be enough to secure first place for Group 18. But will it be enough to make it into Round 2? So your final score is Diecast Dragon with 7, Ragtag Racing Garage with 5, and Liam's Hot Garage with 4. This will bring us to Group 19, so let's take a look at the teams. And the Hot Wheels boys will be driving in. And the Hot Wheels boys is a veteran team from Season 1, who already has accumulated one win. Then we have Jack, John, and Katie Racing in the BMW 2002. And in the Chrysler Thunderbolt, we have VCD 132 Racing. Let's do it. Which one? And Group 19 is at the starting grid, and there they go. They have reached the band and going around. Oh, we have a major crash by the BMW 2002. As he crashes off a spectator's vehicle, it looks like they're okay. And taking full advantage of that is the Chrysler Thunderbolt. And coming in second was the Koenigsegg Yesco. And what a tragedy for the BMW 2002. We hope they're okay. It looks like they're right, but he actually collided off the spectator's truck, landed on top of the Koenigsegg Yesco, which slowed down the Hot Wheels, boys. And this gave way to an easy victory for VCD 132 Digital Racing. So after race one, we got VCD 132 Racing with three, Hot Wheels boys with two, and Jack, John, and Katie Racing with zero. We suffered that unfortunate DNF. Race two. And race two is off. And there they go, reaching the bend, whipping around that corner, and this is gonna be close. So there's a good bit of code as a guess go for the BMW 2002, and this is too close. And the Chrysler Thunderbolt actually was applying pressure but lost control at the last moment, slammed into the wall, and did a 180, and he crosses the finish line backwards. But let's see what happened here. This is too close to call. Who's it gonna be? 
the BMW and the Koenigsegg Gasco are going neck and neck, and it looks like the Koenigsegg Gasco might have got him by a dead fly on the fender, and let's see who got it. And indeed, it was the Koenigsegg Gasco as he barely nudges out the BMW 2002. This will give Hot Wheels boys their second career win here in their second season of Threes Racing, and wow, you cannot get much closer than that. So after race two, the Hot Wheels boys in the first of five, VCD 132 racing for Jack, John, and Katie racing with two. Last race. And the last race of the day is off as group 19 whips around that corner and the Chrysler Thunderbolt blows past the Cones and Gesco and the BMW 2002 comes in out of nowhere grabbing second place and the Hot Wheels boys find themselves in last place for race three. And what an effort by the Chrysler Thunderbolt and VCD 132 Racing grabs his second career victory of the day. And then he had the last minute overtake by the BMW 2002 on the Hot Wheels Boys Koenigsegg Gasco. So your final score for Group 19 will be VCD 132 Racing with 7, Hot Wheels Boys with 6, and Jack, John, and Katie Racing with 4. So that concludes the regular season for Season 2, and let's see who made it into the playoffs. Any team with an X by their name has clinched a playoff spot, and any team with eight points will move on to the play-ins, which will be a short one versus one best of three matchup between four teams. And the winner of those two matchups will move on to see who will be in the playoffs on their quest to see who will walk away with the season two championship. We here at Toon Tracks Racing would like to thank every team that has participated and this long and arduous season for Threes Racing as we had 57 teams compete to see who will gain the title for Season 2. And the quest still goes on as the playoffs are now set to begin. And keep in mind that the play-ins will not count towards stats. So we will see you guys here again soon at Team Tracks Racing. Take care and... See you on track.